it occurred to him that a mannequin might be sufficient to meet his needs. And so he hid in a department store restroom till after closing, emerged to steal a male mannequin. He managed to get it home to his grandmother's house and was using that to cuddle in his grandma's basement. I wanted to find a way to satisfy myself without hurting anyone. I just went through various sexual fantasies with it, pretending it was uh, a real person. After having killed several different men and disposed of their remains, Dahmer was feeling, this is such a waste. He thought, maybe I could incorporate some of that person into myself so they could live on in that way. You're looking good though, look nice and trim. Oh, that's good to hear. You look like you're working out. No. No, I've been surviving on McDonald's food. I am writing in regard to my son, Jeff Dahmer. I have reservations regarding Jeff's chances when he hits the streets. I sincerely hope that you might intervene, intervene in some way to help my son, who I love very much and for whom I want a better life. I do feel though that this may be our last chance to initiate something lasting. Emergency operator 71. Okay, hi. Um, this um, I'm on 25th and State, and this is young man. He is butt naked. He has been beaten up. He is very bruised up. He was trembling. He was shaking. And as I was speaking to the operator, there was a man who appeared. He yanks the boy up, and then I see blood in his rectum when he yanked him up like that. At this point, I really get physical like let him go you know you know he not going with you he not going with you fire department ended up coming first and i'm flagging the police car the man was saying he's my friend he's okay he drunk and he wandered off i'm like excuse me i don't think he know him because he was saying and they was like wait we'll get to you those people didn't even look at me i said you know what let me go in here to my auntie house real fast in and out tell her like something ain't right Come back outside. Everybody gone. So I really didn't really know 100% if he ended up going to the hospital. And so I talked to my auntie and I was telling her like, maybe you could, I don't know, call to see. Hello, is that the watch, please? Yes, uh, I, I, that was a squad car, number 68, that was flagged down earlier this evening, about right. 15 minutes ago. That was me. Yeah. Uh, what happened? I mean... It's an uh, intoxicated uh, boyfriend of another boyfriend. Well, how old was this child? It wasn't a child, it was an adult. Are you sure? Yep. It was just devastating. It affected me very greatly. 